Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Jess and I do natural hair videos. So today I am going to be going over the aftercare of what I do when I take out a protective style. So I just took out my yarn twist that I had in for about a week and a half, two weeks. And I am going to be showing you all the steps that I take to get my hair back to its healthy, moisturized state. So if this is something that you're interested in, just keep right on watching. So the first thing that I'm going to do is number one, shed a tear hmm. because this twist out y'all. Okay. I just had to take a moment and acknowledge how bomb this twist out is. Okay. We just had to take a moment and do that. Okay. I'm sorry. But yeah. So the first thing I'm going to do is get ready to pre-poo my hair and I am going to be using my oil mixture. You guys already know. Um, I have Jamaican black castor oil olive oil, tea tree oil, and the African space herbal oil that they have. And then I have water in here. And so all I'm gonna do is go in section by section and um, just spray each section and then do a light little finger detangle and twist up each section. And then um, I'll get ready to hop in the shower and shampoo my hair. Okay, so um, I'm all done and everything, and um, I'm gonna put my hair, I am going to, uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get a shower cap and I'm going to put it over my hair. I'm gonna wait probably about like 15 minutes or so. Um, since I have high porosity hair, I don't have to wait 30 minutes. Lucky me, um, but nah, but so I'm gonna get a shower cap put it over my hair and I'm gonna let it sit for about 15 minutes and then I'm gonna go ahead and shampoo. And then when I come back, that's when I'll do my next steps as far as what I do to get my hair back popping. Okay, so I'm fresh out the shower and my hair has been shampooed. And this is what it's looking like. So I like to kind of see what the beginning result is, okay? Because after I do all of this, you guys are gonna see how much definition and stuff like that my hair is gonna get because right now, I got none. I got nada, okay? It's nothing but just hair. <laughs> like, in the back you can see some curls, but honestly, my hair doesn't have definition a lot of times. So, I am going to use 
my handy dandy rice water. I'm gonna use my rice water and then I'm going to use my deep conditioner on top of it. I'm going to use my Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen and Restore Treatment Mask. That's what I'm gonna be using over the rice water. So I'm gonna rice water treatment, which is my protein treatment and do my deep conditioning treatment at the same time. Two birds, one stone. And guys, for real, I literally just got out the shower not even five minutes ago and my hair is already starting to dry up. The downside of high porosity hair. But first, I'm gonna go over this section and just kind of wet it back up. One, I normally try to get it on my scalp. I always try to at least get it on my scalp first. And then I kind of run it along my hair. conditioner right on top Sorry, I got my shower cap on. I'm gonna leave that on for about 15 to 30 minutes. And then I'm gonna put this on, just to add a little extra layer, not much, but it's something. Um, so like I said, I'm gonna let that sit and I'm probably gonna detangle my hair off camera and then I'm gonna come back once I rinse it out and show you guys how good my hair is gonna be looking because honey, it's gonna be popping, okay? So I can't wait. Okay, so I literally just stepped out the shower okay and you can see that my hair is still like dripping wet you can already tell that that deep condition and rice water already did wonders for my hair because of the way my hair shrunk up because healthy hair shrinks like and one of the things i do want to talk about is the shedding that i got so after doing the rice water and deep conditioning and all that good jazz this is my shedding that i had okay that's not all the shedding, give me one second. This is the shedding that I had from when I was taking out or when I was detangling my hair, when I was pre-pulling and things like that. Um, so um, I don't think this is honestly too bad for it to be like two weeks. You lose about a hundred strands a day. So it's not too bad, too, not too shabby. And then afterwards, this was all I had left after my deep conditioning session and my protein treatment with the rice water. So. I don't think I lost that much hair, y'all. And then, I know it's not much, but compared to earlier, the definition is definitely there. You know, you 
can see curls trying to come through. Earlier, it was just a frizz ball. Like, even in the front, I mean, they trying. They not all the way there, but they trying, okay? Especially in this part right here. This little area right here is my problem area, but all of this, like, look at that. Definition. But yeah, so the next steps I will take is I'm just gonna add some leave-in conditioner and everything like that, and then I'll go ahead into my process as far as like whatever style I'm gonna do. Um, so I might do a wash and go. I think I might do a twist out. Check out my next video to find out. So that's all I'm gonna do for today. And if you guys have any questions or anything like that about the rice water or deep conditioner or anything like that, you know, comment down below and don't forget to subscribe, like my video, share it, do all that good jazz. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.